everyone, it's Mrs. Fitzsimmons. I'm going to start first by saying hello to each one of you like we did last time. Hi, Henley. Hi, Cyan. Hi, Josie. Hi, Harper. Hi, Eliza. Hello, Hank. Oh, wait. And happy birthday, Hank. Your birthday was yesterday. Hi, James. Hi, Rose. Hi, Aiden. Hi, Carolina. Hi, Henry. Hi, Cassie. Oh, wait, I forgot someone. Does anyone remember who else was gonna watch this experiment? Hi, Rupert. He's around here somewhere. Okay, this week we're talking all about eggs and Easter. Um, an egg is oval shaped, which I think a lot of you know. And I'm gonna first talk to you about the different parts of an egg. The outside of an egg, whether it's brown or white, is called the shell, and it's hard, and it protects what's inside the egg. So I'm gonna crack this egg and show you what an egg looks like. This egg is raw. You don't eat raw eggs, but here's the shell. And then inside the shell are the yolk and the egg white. And right now, this egg has not been cooked. But if you cook an egg, and then it looks like this. Again, here's the shell, here's the egg white, and here is the yolk. This egg can be eaten just like this. This one needs to be cooked. So we're gonna do two egg experiments right now. I'm gonna move this out of the way. And the first experiment involves two glasses of water and two eggs. The first glass of water just is gonna have regular water in it. And in the second glass of water, I'm gonna put lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of salt. I'm gonna stir it. So, in this glass, we just have plain old water. What do you think is gonna happen when I put this egg into the plain water? Well, let's see. It sank, it went to the bottom of the glass. I'm gonna give this one a little bit of a stir again. Again, this one is full of salt water. Let's see what happens when we put an egg in water that's filled with salt. You see that? It's poking its head out of the top, so it floated. So an egg, when it's in salt water, floats, and an egg that gets put in plain water sinks. You can try that at home, too, to see if you really think it happens. It's very cool. Now we're going to move these out of the way, and we're going to do one other experiment. This is a raw egg, an egg that looks like this inside. So it moves around inside the shell. Actually, this one's the hard boiled. This is the raw egg, and this egg is hard boiled. So it looks like this, it's cooked. It doesn't move inside the shell. And we're gonna do a spinning experiment. So I'm gonna spin the raw egg, and then I'm gonna spin the hard boiled egg. And I wanna see which one spins better. Which one do you think is gonna spin better? Well, let's see. Here goes the raw egg, ready? Hmm, that didn't work very well, now did it? So the raw egg, it moves around inside, did not spin very well. Let's see what happens with the cooked egg. Hmm, which one do you think did a better job of spinning? We'll try that one more time. This is the raw egg where it's moving around inside. Okay, and this is the cooked egg, the hard boiled egg where it's a solid inside, it's not moving. Very cool, right? Okay, I'm gonna say bye. Those are our egg experiments. I hope you had fun.